and there hasn't been a Good morning, everyone. Uh, we're going to sing 708. Spirit. May we celebrate the memorial of St. Barnabas, the Apostle, and offer this Mass for Louise and Lydia. And gather together as God's family, let us take some time to acknowledge our sins. You were sent to heal the contrite of hearts. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came. Call sinners, Christ have mercy. Christ have mercy. You are seated at the right hand of the Father to intercede for us. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us. Forgive us our sins. Bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who decreed that St. Barnabas, a man filled with faith and the Holy Spirit, should be set apart to convert the nations, grant that the gospel of Christ, which he strenuously preached, may be faithfully proclaimed by word and by deed. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. reading from the Acts of the Apostles. In those days, a great number who believed turned to the Lord. The news about them reached the ears of the church in Jerusalem, and they sent Barnabas to go to Antioch. He had arrived and saw the grace of God. He rejoiced and encouraged them all to remain faithful to the Lord in firmness of heart. For he was a good man, filled with the Holy Spirit and faith. And a large number of people was added to the Lord. Then he went to Tarshish to look for Paul, to, for, to look for Saul. And when he had found him, he brought him to Antioch. For a whole year they met with the church and taught a large number of people. And it was in Antioch that the disciples were first called. Christians. Now there were in the church at Antioch prophets and teachers, Barnabas, Simeon, who was called Niger, Lucius of Cyrene, Menaean, who was a close friend of Herod the Tetrarch, and Saul. While they were worshiping the Lord and fasting, the Holy Spirit said, Set apart for me Barnabas and Saul for the work to which I have called them. Then, completing their fasting and prayer, they laid hands on them and sent them off. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. 
The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. The Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. Sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done wondrous deeds. His right hand has won victory for him, his holy arm. The Lord, the Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. The Lord has made his salvation known in the sight of the nations. He has revealed his justice. He has remembered his kindness and his faithfulness towards the house of Israel. The, the Lord, Lord has revealed, revealed to the nations his saving power. All the ends of the earth have seen the salvation of our God. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lands. Break into song, sing praise. The Lord, the Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. Sing praise to the Lord with the harp, with the harp and melodious song. His trumpets and the sound of the horn sing joyfully before the king, the Lord. The, the Lord, Lord has revealed to the nations his saving power. says the Lord, I am with you always until the end of the world. Alleluia. 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 The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory Amen. to you, O Lord. Jesus said to the twelve, as you go, make this proclamation the kingdom of heaven is at hand cure the sick raise the dead cleanse lepers drive out demons without cost you have received without cost you are to give do not take gold or silver or copper for your belts no sack for the journey or second tunic or sandals or walking stick the laborer deserves his keep whatever town or village you enter look for a worthy person in it and stay there until you leave as you enter a house, wish it peace. If the house is worthy, let your peace come upon it. If not, let your peace return to you. Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. So we celebrate uh, Saint Barnabas, uh, uh, apostle, and. Uh, I guess he's not as famous as some of the other apostles, you know, like a, like a Peter. You know, everybody knows Peter. And even, even before the mass, uh, Father Mark, we were talking about uh, what, what, what color do we wear for Saint <laughs> part of this? We, we, I, I think he's, I think it's red. You know, so uh, not as famous. We probably know more about Barabbas rather than Barnabas. You know, Barabbas, the one that you know Jesus. They said crucify him, and they release Barabbas. You know, probably no more Barabbas than Barnabas. You know, um, but the uh, <clears throat> we know that uh, Barnabas he worked, you know, as you heard from the first reading, he worked side by side with with, with Paul, uh, with the Gentiles. He converted many people, and they, and, they, and they said he converted so many people that people thought he was a god. People thought he was Zeus. You know, and you're like, no, 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 you and I are the same. We proclaim to you good news that you should return from these idols to the living God. And the word uh, Barnabas, right? Um, like I said, it's not, it's not a common you know, name. Do you know anybody named Barnabas? You know, I, I, I don't. <laughs> you know, maybe you do, okay? But uh, the word, the name Barnabas means son of consolation. Son of consolation. And I think we really need that during these times, uh, to be people of consolation, to people that bring consolation, right? And uh, for me, I, I'm a typical, uh, I don't know, try to, try to fix things, you know? So like, 
if I go to a, somebody's house and I see a baby crying, and I, if I'm trying to console a baby, I'm like, okay, well, what do you need? Stop crying. Here, here, eat, eat something. Here's some candy. Stop crying. Like, well, 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 you know? Um, or, you know, in, in, in a relationship, you know, uh, typically in a boyfriend girlfriend relationship, you know, when, when the girlfriend is upset or crying, or whatever, the boyfriend's always like, okay, uh, how do I fix this? What, 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 what do you want me to do to fix this? Right? But consolation is not necessarily about fixing things or doing things, but it's about, I think, just actively listening and being with that person. Right? Uh, co- consolation is not always just, oh, everything will be all right, okay, here's $100, or here's some candy, you know? But it's actually act- being with that person. And I think in terms of what we're seeing in the news all the time, you know, uh, you know, I, I forgot which article, the Yahoo article, and like Matthew McConaughey or something like this, but, you know, basically white people are asking, how do I fix this? What do I have to do? The Black Lives Matter, okay, I understand protests, okay, I understand prejudice, all what, what do I do? Do, I, do you want me to spend money on black businesses? Do you want me to pick it? You know, what do you want me to do? Like, I think a lot of African Americans are saying, no, 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 no. Consolation is not about you fixing things, but it's about you being in our space, right? Consolation is about journeying together, right? Not you fixing things for me, right? Um, and I think that is also required in evangelization. That is also required in, in, in sharing the good news. It's not necessarily about, okay, do you believe in God? Do this, do that, do that. You know, go, go, go to church, go, to, go pray the rosary. You know, those are all wonderful things, but consolation, right, and the way uh, I think Barnabas, he was so effective in, in preaching the news is just being with people, you know, uh, active listening. Well, we, we, everybody says, you know, that it's a code word, active listening, right? But really practicing that as a way of uh, consolation, as, as the name Barnabas means, son of consolation. So think about today, uh, maybe somebody that you know is going through a difficult time, or somebody that's really struggling with this whole, you know, uh, prejudice, racism, protest, all these things, and just have a conversation, not necessarily to fix it, but to just journey and bring that sense of consolation, that peace uh, with that person today. united with the apostles and preachers from every age. Let us pray that God may raise up in the church faithful witnesses to the risen Christ, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That catechists may be enlivened in their ministry by the presence of the Holy Spirit, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That co-workers in ministry may work together in harmony and trust, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. That the sick may find comfort in those who care for them, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. And in the science of our hearts, let us ask God for our own intentions. For these prayers, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. And that the dead may rejoice forever with the apostles, we pray. Lord, hear our prayer. God of consolation, the apostle Barnabas proclaimed your word, announcing the good news to the nations. Send us forth in spirit of power to be messengers of charity, reconciliation, that all nations may glorify you through Jesus Christ forever. Amen. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the bread we offer you. Through the earth, with the human hands, will become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God forever.
Blessed are you, Lord, God of all creation, for through your goodness we have received the wine we offer you. Fruit of the vine, where the human hands will become our spiritual drink. Blessed be God forever. Pray, my brothers and my sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and good of all his holy church. Sanctify with your blessing, we pray, O Lord, the offerings presented here, so that by your grace they may set us on fire with the flame of your love, by which St. Barnabas brought the light of the gospel to the nations, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just. A duty or salvation, always, everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, Eternal God. For you, Eternal Shepherd, do not desert your flock, but through the blessed apostles, watch over it, protect it always, so that it may be governed by those you have appointed shepherds to lead it in the name of your Son. And so, with the angels, archangels, with thrones and dominions, and with all the hosts and powers of heaven, we sing the hymn of your glory as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed. Holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness, make holy, therefore, these gifts we pray by sending down your spirit upon them, like the dew fall, so that they may become for us body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread, giving thanks, broke it, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice once more giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Oscar, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, and blessed Joseph, her spouse, with your blessed apostles, St. Barnabas, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Amen. At the Savior's command, and formed by his divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For us, Lord, we pray from every evil, graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we have the blessed hope in the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. 
For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace. I give you without our sins by the faith of your church, and graciously grant you peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. May the peace of the Lord be with you always. And with and your spirit. spirit. Let us offer each other a sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us your peace. Behold, Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my room, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed. Prayer of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe you are present in the most blessed sacrament. I love you above all things and desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot now receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Let us pray. As we receive the pledge of eternal life, we humbly implore you, Lord, that what we celebrate in sacramental signs on the memorial of the blessed apostle Barnabas, we may one day behold unveiled through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Our Mass is ended. Go in peace. Thanks be to God. Immaculate Mary, your praises we sing. You reign now in splendor with Jesus our King. Ave, Ave, Ave.